a computer has 256 kilobyte four way set associative write back data cache with block size of 32 bytes now this is a set associative cache so that means we will be having a few sets in the cache and each each set would be consisting of four blocks because this is a four way set associative so if it is set 0 it will have block 0 block 1 block 2 and block 3 similarly set 1 would be also having four blocks and so on so each set over here would be having four blocks now the processor sends a 32 bit address to the cache controller and each cache tag directory entry contains in addition to the address tag two valid bits one modified bit and one replacement bit so the number of bits in the tag field and the size of the cache tag directory this is what is required to be computed now the cache size is 256 kilobyte if we convert this into bytes so this is 256 into 2 to the power of 10 the block size is 32 bytes so to specify any block any offset within that block that means a particular byte within a block we will require 5 bits so for this offset 5 bits will be required so within a block if i want to address a particular byte i can use 5 bits for that address to a to particular access that particular byte how many blocks are there in the cache the total size which is 256 into 2 to the power of 10 divided by the block size so we get 8 into 2 to the power of 10 which is 2 to the power of 13 these are the total number of blocks in the cache but now these blocks are arranged as sets and in each set there are four blocks so if we divide the total number of blocks by the number of blocks in each set we will get the number of sets the total number of sets which comes out to be 2 to the power of 11 so if we want to specify a particular set in the cache since there are 2 to the power of 11 sets we will require 11 bits to specify the set now the total number of address bits are 32 so 32 minus the bits required to specify the set and minus the bits required to specify the offset we are left with 16 bits so there will be 16 bits in the tag so each block over here when it is having an associated tag each tag would have 16 bits now apart from these tags there are two valid bits one modified bit and one replacement bit as well so the total number of bits in each tag entry is 20 bits and how many blocks are there because this tag is associated with each block not with a set but e with each block and the number of blocks in the cache are 2 to the power of 13 so 2 to the power of 13 into 20 these many bits and this will give us approximately 160 kilobits